Lori, your last demonstrator, and I'm going to show you how to make an awesome wall hanging. I want you to go get your favorite picture. I got mine. I'm going to take a picture of my garden from last year of my sunflowers, and I'm going to display them on a wall hanging that I want everyone to see in my house. So let's get started. I have this picture right here, which I cut into a square, and I glued it right onto this little wall hanging where you can have a little hook and hang things on this hook as well. And what I'm gonna do is take my tool with my cotton ball, I'm gonna grab a little cotton ball here, we'll push that in a little bit more, glue down your picture, and then we're gonna pastel this sunflower look. So I'm gonna take three scoops, and I'm just gonna color that right onto the black and white picture. So three more scoops of my non-smear pastels here, and I'm just gonna take my yellow, let's go and get a darker color. So we're gonna go into the darker orange, and I just color that right onto my flower. We'll take a little brown for the middle. Again, you can go from color to color. Any color you want works. We'll take a little bit more of my yellow for this part over here. And if I ever mess up and get some over the flower, I can always erase this with my eraser. So I got a little piece right along the edge here. Just take the eraser and erase that right off. We're gonna go back into a little bit of a dark, dark orange. And we'll color the middle part over here. And then we'll go right into the second sunflower. So let's color this angle, this side in. We'll take a little bit of my yellow. And I'm gonna get those little leaves and petals. Now, a step that you haven't seen yet is our chamois cloth. And that gets all of the excess pastels off here in case you want to leave this we're going to just tap that off take the cloth and just dab it so that way that'll seal all the pastels right into your paper if you have to erase at all you can erase it right off there next i'm going to use my glazed dimensions and i'm going to just add this right into the middle of my sunflower here just so the middle of this pops right through so you get your glazed look and your 3d look how we've been discussing this whole time. So we'll just put a little bit on here. This again takes 10 minutes to dry. Put some right in the middle. Put some right in the middle of that one. And I'm gonna let that dry and then I'm gonna hang that right onto my wall. So what I did was I hung mine in my bathroom, which you can see I put a little nail in the door and I hung that right up. And then you can take whatever colors that you use for your flowers, take the color of the towel and hang that right on there. So I get my beautiful towel holder and everyone will see it.